All right, so namaste and many, many blessings to our beautiful moms of the being you world. I love you all so much. And today we're just going to do a beautiful meditation to help you kind of recenter into your heart and ground into your beautiful spirit and feel all the love and release some stress that you might be holding on to. So let's bring our hands together, give it a nice gentle rub and close your eyes and just begin by taking a couple of sweet, sweet breaths. And as you're rubbing your hands together, just feel your breath coming in, feel your breath going out. Exhale completely. And just see if you can go a little bit deeper with your breath with every breath that you breathe. And as you're rubbing your hands together, begin to feel the light body becoming illuminated, becoming vibrant and joyful and bright. Begin to experience the pulsation of your rhythms, the spin of your chakras, and the beautiful colors that are coming to your mind's eye. And when you can feel your hands grabbing onto each other, you know that you have activated your entire light body. Just give it a couple more rubs. And then bring your hands into prayer position and plug right into the center of the heart. And as soon as you hit that heart center, really connect to you as if you are putting a key into a beautiful lock or just lock onto you. The moment your hands come to your heart in prayer position, the entire universe disappears. And it's all you right here in this moment, in this gentle touch, in this very self-loving mudra. And so just kind of hold here for a moment. Let the mind relax and release all tension and thoughts. Allow the body with the breath to release and to expand all of your beautiful stress. Let it out. Let your light flow into all those places. I didn't mean to say your stress is beautiful. I meant to say your light is beautiful. Let it from the core of your being wash every part of you clear. Or just push out your light from the center and picture yourself becoming so bright. Give yourself permission to open. And now take a moment and in your heart, I'm sure you have a list of things that you've got in your heart a list of people, a list of activities, a to-do list from the heart and the mind. How about if we just take those lists for just a moment and put them into a beautiful pair of white hands. Let's delegate to one of your guides or to spirit, to God, universe, however you prefer to see it. Place your to-do list into those divine hands. I know that every single thing that you care about is now in good hands. Let yourself know in every part of you that all those loves that you have are taken care of for the time that you're going to spend here with you. And all those activities that need to be performed are being put into the hands of the universe and just given to God. Let go, let go, let go. And now this makes a little bit of extra space knowing that your, your burdens, your duties, your responsibilities, and your cares and worries are all in good hands. Now come back to the heart. Turn your inner mind inward into the very center of your heart chakra. Take a nice deep loving breath and let yourself spark the pink flame of unconditional love right in the center of your wide open beautiful green Anahata chakra, your heart space. So as you begin to envision that, just kind of turn your inner attention downwards and inwards. See that pink flame with every breath growing in size, growing in size, becoming stronger and brighter. Super, super loving. This is the pink flame of chi, life force energy. And so I want to invite you to begin your meditation today by seeing yourself as your divine spirit, stepping into this beautiful pink flame. And you'll notice as you walk into it that your light body soaks it in. It feels so good to step into 
this flame of love. And it's as thick and rich as if you stepped your body into an ocean, you would feel the pressure of the water around you. And so as you step into the pink heart flame, feel its texture, feel its softness wrapping around your skin. Envision yourself completely saturated by this beautiful, comforting, buffering pink love. And as you take a few breaths, just really relax your spirit. Imagine that your spirit is stepping into the spa of this pink energy and lounge here. Just allow yourself to relax. And then as your spirit is doing that inside of your heart, begin to envision also that this pink flame is now igniting around your entire body, that it is coming down from the highest sources of God's purest love down through your soul star and this beautiful liquid light, this wonderful mana prana energy chi is creating a sacred space around your whole body. And very soon you are enveloped in what feels like a womb of unconditional love, unconditional empowerment, unconditional light. Now, this does not mean that you are childlike. This does not mean that you are a baby. This is you, the goddess that you are, in the heart of the goddess's energy, in a space of creative empowerment, in a beautiful sanctuary of unconditional love where there is so much quietude and peace. And where you really choose to allow yourself to feel the love that is available for you. And so come home to this love, come home to this beautiful, sweet, safe, kind, loving, easy space. And just breathe, feel your whole body relaxing all tension from the top of your head to the bottoms of your toes. Feel your breath slowing down. And as you wish, you can bring your hands down into your lap or Perhaps even just put them on your body somewhere that feels right to do so. And just continue to hold that vision that you are being saturated by so much love. Allow the universe of love to care for you. For as much caring as that you have given outward to others, allow 10 times more to come into you. Allow 100 times more to come into you. Receive the divine dispensation of caring. And truly know in every fiber of your being, in every thought, in every feeling, that you are loved, that you are cherished, that you are cared for, that you are blessed. Now take another beautiful deep breath and envision the little spirit that you are the guardian for entering this sacred space with you. Welcome the guides and guardians of both you and your child. I begin to feel a wonderful connection. Remember that the responsibilities that you have for your little one are yours in a human sense, but are also belonging to the ones who watch over them in a spiritual sense. And so take a few moments and allow them to be cared for by their guardians and remember that they are truly loved and protected in every possible way. And if you wish to ask for a specific kind of a protection for your little one, a special shield, a special blessing, a special dispensation, just to ask your little one's guides and guardians to do so. Perhaps you want them to have an immunity shield from the stress of the COVID world. They are capable of receiving that from their guides. Perhaps you wish to help them to have a better night's sleep or to digest a little bit better. If there's any physical human challenges they face, you can ask for help and blessings directly from their team and spirit. 
And so as you trust and know that these little beings are in every possible way loved and cared for, including that they have a soul contract, that they are here in this lifetime to learn very specific lessons and that they signed up for everything that they're journeying through, including this moment in time. Allow yourself to actually feel that contract. Allow yourself to remember that you signed it too. And that in signing it, this is a blessed contract. They are always and ever will be in God's hands and on the path that their spirit needs to walk and wishes to walk. And so my friends, if you have any guilt or any remorse or any self attack for not doing something well enough, good enough, happy enough, bright enough, release all of this. And remember that you are too on that contract doing a phenomenal job. So let go of all judgment and just take a few sweet violet flame breaths and feel the sacred violet fire coming through the field of judgment, clearing the field. Letting go of all that extra responsibility stress that you put on yourself or that the world has put on you. And allow there to be a purification, just a very simple return to the state of love, the state of commitment, the state of grace that has brought you and this little soul together. And then taking a beautiful deep breath, allow yourself to release. Remember that you are a wonderful being. You are a fabulous mom. Remember that you are a being who has a unique set of talents and viewpoints and pieces of consciousness. You are the perfect teacher for this little one. You are the perfect guardian. You are so equipped for everything that they need. And what you don't have, they will have with other people on their contract. So restore a sense of gratitude and self-love. Restore a sense of self-confidence and self-security. And as you're breathing in and breathing out, allow this little being to be in the care of its guardians and come back to the heart center of you. And now begin to feel a solid singular pyramid of white light being built around your spirit and around your body. Feel this white pyramid opening the root chakra of your being and projecting this white sanctuary around your entire body, a space that only you occupy. And so inside of the collective field of love and relationships, there is a white sacred space. And as you ground here into this white domain, tap back into your unique identity, your unique beauty, the unique force of divine substance that propels you constantly. And allow yourself to choose powerfully of your own free will to be the goddess that you came here in this world to be. Give yourself permission to take on your power once again, despite all external situations, despite all identity roles that you play out in your humanity. Remember that you are a goddess first. And despite what you think about yourself, you have always been a goddess first. You are a powerful being. You are a wise being. You are a loving being. You are a matriarch of your world and you are an influencer in all the relationships that you hold and all the spaces that you occupy. My love, you bring the light. And so if you feel depleted, used, taken advantage of, influenced by outside things. In this now perfect moment, here and now, in this beautiful light, standing strong in the center of your pyramid that is an impenetrable force of divine light and source, 
right here, right now, claim your space. Stand strong, feel the blessings of your light and allow yourself to be completely recharged, completely recentered, completely regrounded into the goddesshood of your being. And in doing so, begin to feel a surge of energy from the root rising through your channel, a beautiful wave of kundalini fire rising through your spine. Feel the wonderful resources of inner spirit penetrating the consciousness of your being, expressing throughout every particle, every cell, every thought, every field outwards in every direction across the entire force field of life, stake your claim. Turn your light up, release it to the world, but know that the center of you is impenetrable. It is strong, it is beautiful, it is vibrant, it is whole. It may have gone dormant for a brief moment, but you are a goddess of this universe. So take a beautiful deep breath and come home. Come home to you. Come home to your I identity, the I am that you are. Step into this shower of light. Step into this sacred space. Claim your right to be here. And allow the entire universe to bless you as you do so. Allow the entire world of humanity to accept this as so, whether they like it or not. Sorry to say it like that, but it is what it is. And you stand here strong in this beautiful light. And as you do this, notice in the ethers, off in the distance, your little one is doing the same. Your little one has been placed into their white pyramid of identity. They are grounding into their beautiful, powerful light, just like you are. And you do this not for them, but as you do this for you, you inspire others to do the same. And there is no better thing to do than to be your light. And so from the center of your being, from the center of your purest, highest, most radiant light, Express to you once and for all through the you of the infinite you through all of time and all of space that I am who I am. Wherever I go, there I am. Here I am. I am that I am. Let it be known through everything, everywhere, every when. I am the light of my being. I am the love of my being. I am the wisdom of my light and love. And so here I am, I am here. Take a few breaths, feel the pyramid of light around you, not as a separate object, but as a part of you, becoming so permanently established in the etheric field around you that you have unleashed the light from within. And it is now creating around your body, around your life, around the territory that you occupy, a sanctuary of purification, a sanctuary of lovingness, a sanctuary of empowerment and beauty and grace, of hope, of optimism, of happiness and joy, of peace and success of tranquility and awareness, of insight and intuition and inspiration. And honestly, my beautiful friend, of all good things. So just take a moment, bask in your light, bask in the spirit of you. And know that the world allows this of you. Know that your family allows this of you. Know that spirit allows this of you. 
And I don't say allows as a permission slip. We're not really asking for permission, but you are allowed to be the light of your being. Know this to be truth. Know this to be real. Remember who you are. You are not just a mother. That is a role that you play. You are not just a wife. That is just a role that you play. You are not just a sister, a daughter, a friend, but those are roles that you have chosen to play. No, my friends, what you are, who you are, is the light of your being. This is unchangeable. It is written. It is so in every possible way. And as you come home to yourself, as you remember your light, as you sink into its power, its grace, its beneficialness, its blessedness, its belovedness, you remember all the joy of your being. And so now just breathe. Allow the universe to reset for you around the center of your light. Just And now, my beautiful friends, bring your hands to prayer position at the heart. Anchor into the heart, into the love of your being. Into the sacredness of your light once again. Remember every time you come here to the prayer position at the heart chakra, this mudra creates infinite balance and harmony in all parts of your being brings you home to your love, brings you home to your light. It clears your field of all unwanted energies and on one single breath, you remember the light of your being. And so powerfully, beautifully, self-lovingly, self-confidently take that incredible breath. Exhale completely as you come back into this moment as if to say, here I am, I am here. And with so much love, so it is. Begin to feel all of your senses, begin to feel your body and your breath. Begin to feel the air on your skin and the gravity underneath you. And without disconnecting from anything you've created for yourself, allow yourself to come all the way back in this moment with love and gratitude, with a happy heart, with a free spirit, with a big, beautiful, bold, bright light. Come all the way back and open your eyes. Take one more deep breath as you open your eyes. Notice that you're still in that field of spirit. Notice you are still centered in your heart and grounded in your beautiful light. Notice that you are still surrounded by layers of protection and peace, beautiful blessings and belovedness. And the universe has your back. So from my heart to yours, know that I love you so much. I respect you infinitely and I care about you enormously. So let me bow to your beautiful light and say namaste. Namaste, my friends, and thank you so much for being you. I love you.